I'm 34 years in Diageo and I guess I would say this is the most exciting um, project I've ever been involved in in Diageo. Uh, as a project, uh, the brewery, we commenced construction two years ago, but the project kind of goes back well, well before that, kind of planning, getting the business uh, to sign up to the investment, very significant investment, 169 million euros. Great to have the Taoiseach here today to celebrate with this building only the fourth ever brew house that we've built in our 255 year history here at St. James's Gate. And by the way, did I say that we're only 255 years into our 9,000 year lease? So we're here for the long run. Guinness and Diageo support 20,000 jobs in Ireland. We are the biggest purchaser of barley and of dairy outside of the cooperatives. And because so much of what we brew here will be for export markets around the world, that contributes to 800 million euro worth of Ireland's export economy. The recipes are still absolutely based on the same principles as they were from the start, but Guinness has always pursued innovation, science, to constantly evolve the way that we can take new innovation and add it to the traditions of, uh, of the past. I'm fourth generation. My great-grandfather started here in the 1880s and he started in the brewing department and he stayed in the brewing department all his life. And in his final years he spent as head stoker in number one brew house. This investment helps us secure the future of brewing in St. James Gate in Dublin and in Ireland for, for Guinness and all the other brands that we manufacture here and brew here. It means a lot to, to me and to my family and to other people working in the brewery who have been here for generations as well that there's a future in Dublin and in Ireland for the Guinness brand and everyone that works here. We've created a flexible brewing operation that delivers a competitive cost base for us, allows us to compete with the big brewers all around the world. We ship to 130 countries and from this brewery, 70% of what we make goes abroad, 800 million contribution to the Irish economy um, and we are now cost competitive with the best in the world um, and success for us is uh, that we grow Guinness all around the world and we continue to ship it from Dublin. Uh, that's, uh, that's my aim.